and welcome to another video over here. For those new, I am Rafi. I'm a medical doctor, but someone who also likes everything tech and travel and gadgets and gizmos. And today, I have a package that's part unboxing, but part also something for the surface. So let's get started. So what's in here? So this is a brand that I found recently on Amazon, as you can tell. This is my new unboxing knife, which I've already cut my finger with here. So it's pretty sharp. Let's take a look. And this one is the Attaway one, tempered glass for the Surface Pro Plus. And this one is compatible with the, I'm sure, not sure if I can see it. So it's compatible with the X as well as the 8 and 9. Interestingly, nowhere does it say that it's paper like, even though if you search for it on Amazon, it comes up as paper like. So let's have a look and see if it's actually what it says it is. Otherwise, I mean, I do need a screen protector, so this might be ideal. And this one's a two pack, so I got this just in case it wasn't accurate or I wanted to change my mind. But inside, there's two of these and installation tools. I'll keep one aside. There, uh, oh, yep, there we go. So, first thing is that feels solid. There are some small dots that I can see, so maybe it does have a texture. I don't know if that's on the plastic or on the surface. Ah, here we go. So this is position stickers, okay. Cleaning cloth, LCD cleaning wipe. Okay, this is to actually peel the old one away and dust one and position stickers. Okay, are there any instructions on how to do this? Okay, so I just finished watching the video and basically, what you do is you tape this onto here and you have the stickers as a little flap so that it folds down onto it and then you can lift it off after you peel this bit off. So let's get to it. So first steps is to get these stickers after we position it correctly. All the edges are correct. It does slide around quite a bit. One edge done. Another edge done. So basically, we should be able to put this on and lift the whole thing up and down like so. It's going to put an extra couple on. It, it looks pretty level on all sides. probably be a hair lower. So this is why it's kind of nice to have this because you can make your micro adjustments now instead of having to move the whole screen protector and get dust underneath. In a way, this is worse for me because now I'm going to be like micro managing all this. Now, once this bit's done, then comes the cleaning. So that's just rubbish. So this is to clean off any sort of dirt and dust. I'll turn off the screen. This is for any dust. I'm just using the spotlight to see if there's any dust, but this is 
pretty darn good. So we then this off. And place it down. In the video, you could see the... Oh, here we go. Not sure if this is... This is literally what happened on their video, so that's pretty impressive that it's happening exactly like a chode. Now, a little bubble there. There we go. Now, it's definitely a lot more matte. You can see this is like much more shinier. This is a now a matte surface. So it feels like that feels like glass. This feels a lot closer to paper. There's the pen gone. It's definitely a rougher surface, so it feels not quite like paper, like uh, like if this is paper. That is actually closer to paper. So I'm just rubbing it onto a page on this book. That's wood. That's the glass, which is the same as the bows. This is closer to paper than it was before by a long margin. And what I think I've noticed is this, see these little skips here and here? I don't know if that's just me being laggy uh, or a result of the screen protector. See here, there was none of that. So I'm gonna try it again. Okay, so that time it didn't, and I have noticed that it's been a bit laggy, so. I wonder if it's background processes. Okay, so my handwriting's pretty terrible. This looks and feels pretty nice. My concerns are that it did seem to lag out a little bit. There was a couple of little spots. It seems to have fixed itself. I think that was more background processes. The other thing is, it is definitely less smooth than the glass. Wonder if that wears out the tip at all. I can't imagine it would because it is glass at the end of the day it feels so much nicer i gotta say matte effect is really nice i like the fact that the glare is far less noticeable already the thing that i loved about it is that once you watch the youtube video on how to install it it goes exactly like it was i have zero dust or anything and this is not a new surface so i'm pretty impressed at the installation technique and the things they give you to make it as seamless as possible so overall i rate that quite well uh, so if you're looking for a paper-like screen protector for your surface, uh, just in case you wanna, you've been jealous from seeing all the paper-like things from the iPad, the Attaway one is pretty good. So I approve. And of course, subscribe now for even more. Okay, hopefully that video was useful. If you like things like this, please do subscribe because I use this as a metric of what to actually put together for you guys. If you have any comments and whatnot, obviously leave the comments down below. And otherwise, the links to all this stuff will be in the show notes. Just look at the description and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.